Bob Seek, Director of Shuttle Operations here at Kennedy Space Center. This is an exciting time. We, uh, we're in launch count. That always quickens the pulse a little bit. The, uh, there's the added interest in this, obviously, from the, from the nation as well as the, as the whole world. And <laughs> Glad to see you. Jim, how are you? A little different trip this time. Ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. <clears throat> 36 years ago, John Glenn's first trip to orbit was scrubbed by weather four times. On his second trip to orbit tomorrow, we'll see that number improve significantly. <clears throat> Basically, all the right things have come together this week. Uh, as you can see, we have beautiful skies today. Um, high pressures move the southwest. Uh, Mitch, uh, Hurricane Mitch has not uh, threatened us here. And uh, we expect the same story for tomorrow. Before asking your question, down front here with Marsha Dunn. I've been with the crew. We brought the crew down uh, in the T-38s the other day, and they're in very, very good spirits. Uh, last night they had uh, a barbecue get-together with their families out at the beach house, and uh, they're very happy and very excited about uh, all of the, the way things are going in the launch count. Uh, <laughs> We're not sure how, how he will react to long-term in flight. Uh, we've had some people who became ill, and it's quite normal, by the way. About 24 hours, I think it is, isn't it, Bill? Uh, some people start becoming ill, and uh, they acclimate to it eventually. And the space capture crisis, these two kids have same attitude about being a Thank you. 